Residents in Manchester and Trelawney who have been eagerly awaiting the reconstruction of the Troy Bridge, which connects both parishes, were excited when earlier this week the National Works Agency, NWA, started repairs on the damaged bridge. However, an excavator overturned into the Hector's River below. As Courtney Lewis reports in this follow-up, the Member of Parliament for Northwest Manchester and the Mayor of Falmouth say the incident will not delay the job. It's been three years since its collapse, but work on the Troy Bridge, which links northern Manchester and southern Trelawney, finally began this week. And no sooner, in a freak accident, an excavator while demolishing the existing structure overturned into the river Tuesday. The operator of the unit was not severely injured. While speaking on CVM News at noon, Mayor of Falmouth Colin Gager says the National Works Agency is in a position to continue the reconstruction despite the incident. All of the safety concerns have been met. It is just, as I say, the demolition of the old piece of the bridge. And um, the, the NWA, they are, they are, it is early days, and they are doing good, good work. I, I couldn't say otherwise. It's not the NWA fault that, that the, the bridge collapsed. The bridge is old. It's over 100 and odd years old. He was supported by Member of Parliament for Northwest Manchester, Mikhail Phillips, who shared the project is in its early days, and over time, more requirements of the National Works Agency will be more evident. Yes, there ought to have been more safety um, you know, requirements and concerns where the, the operator of the excavator is concerned. We're not denying that. Mm -hmm. um, but I, I spoke to the, the, the NWA and I spoke to the contractor, and I am sure that everything will be put in place, not only for those um, who are working with the contract, but for residents both on the Manchester side and the Trelawney side. Phillips assured the work to reconstruct the bridge will continue bearing the safety of residents and workers in mind. Meanwhile, Mayor Gager remained tight-lipped about further parliamentary representation for residents of Southern Trelawney, as there is currently no sitting member of parliament. I, I don't want to get into that part. Just let me say that I am the councillor for that area. I live in Troy. It is just a stone throw from my house. And of course, I will do as best as I can to make sure that everything is done smoothly. Courtney Lewis for CVM News.